Hey guys, what's up? It's your girl Amelia. Welcome back to my channel. And today we're gonna go, we're gonna go for a run. I was debating even vlogging this because I was like, they don't care. But I feel like the world is really going through a running era, okay? I'm seeing more and more girls get into running and it's really exciting because I'm into running now. I just vlog as a beginner runner, okay? So I don't, we're not running 20 miles today. Okay, we're doing a cute, two or three i think i'm not even sure let me check so i'm training now for a 10k when is this 10k i don't know <laughs> but um i'm gonna train for it just because i want to be able to do it in general um there is one 10k in june that i'm looking forward to maybe doing but if not i'll do the 5k of it but um it's currently april 22nd so we have a little bit of time to train for that not a lot I'm not gonna hold you, not a lot. The program I'm gonna use is Couch to 10K. So there's Couch to 5K and then there's Couch to 10K. Let me show you guys what it looks like. So it's this red app right here. We're gonna skip ahead to week six because um, this literally will take you from Couch to 5K to 10K, but I've already done the 5K. So you're following. It's basically a jog for 10 minutes, walk for a quarter mile, and then another jog so jog a mile walk a quarter mile and then jog another mile so that's about two two miles and some change i'll probably get um i wear different things i started running in the cold so i'm just now getting into running in biker shorts let me so i'm currently wearing biker shorts these are gymshark <laughs> biker shorts these are pretty old i'm not gonna hold you but they are my favorite biker shorts um that i got from gymshark i have never ran in these yet so we're gonna see today how we feel about that my tea is from h&m h&m has a sports gym section not a lot of h&m's have it i've noticed but if you do see the sports section in h&m get their teas these teas are phenomenal and my go-to nike sports bra which is really good for running and just some regular regular socks and my shoes if you follow me on tiktok you've already seen these shoes but these are the brooks shoes these are the what are these called glycerin gts 20 i think hold on glycerin gts 21 that's what these are my first real i'm um, going running shoes that i brought i actually went to a running store and all that um i have that video on my tiktok so if you want to check that out but yes I went to the running store and they recommended these. My favorite way to warm up is with a tennis ball and this is a um, track baton. So I use this to roll out my shins and I use this to roll out my calves. I can do another video on that because that's like a whole thing but those are my two like problem areas when I'm running. I don't know which video is going to come out first. This is my first medal. This is my first 5k medal I got from the Cherry Blossom Washington DC race. Super exciting. I don't know if my video about that race is coming out before this one or is this first? I don't know. Your girl's all over with her posting schedule but that was really exciting. I'm gonna talk about why you should run a 5k and how I felt about running it. So that's gonna be fun. Stay tuned for that. running vest everything is linked on my amazon store if you guys are interested so this is my running vest i have washed her so she's definitely machine wash washable what i keep in here primarily is pepper spray my earphones and um my car keys that's primarily all i keep the back does have a water pouch area i don't use that yet again because i don't run that far to where i'm like dying of thirst but eventually Eventually I will be. Gorgeous, gorgeous day outside. It's only 60 degrees, which is kind of cold, but it's actually, it just feels, it feels perfect for a run. So I'm super excited. Um, and I get really hot when I run. So yeah, I'm gonna put my vest on. I'm debating if I wanna wear my running headband. Let me not debate it, let me just run, wear it. Sometimes I don't like wearing it. This helps keep the sweat out my eyes. 
but I hate how I <laughs> I hate how I look with it sometimes but it does work so let me use it so not only do I carry my headphones and my car keys I also carry my license and a credit card just in case so I just like to have those in here let's just get out of the car and warm up Kinda of mad y'all cause <laughs> I have to pee! <laughs> oh my god. Okay, we're getting started with the warm-up walk and then we're gonna start running. <sighs> Feels really good out here, I'm excited. That was decent. Um, I did a jog one mile, walk for like three, four minutes, then I jogged another mile. So I'm not, I'm not mad at that. I'm just glad I got out there. I'm gonna pick up some meal prep for my new favorite meal prep place, and um, it's super good and something really good to eat quick when I'm hungry. So let's go do that. Okay, so we're finally freshly showered. I had to lay my edge down a little bit. Hey, something is on my screen and it's gonna bother me, so. Okay, that's so much better. We're trying the Asian glazed salmon and what I like about that meal prep place that I go to um, I don't know where else they're located, but I'll leave their website below. But what I like about it, that I just discovered because my friend told me, is that you can use Fitness Pal and scan it and it actually works in Fitness Pal and like other um, meal prep apps. So this meal is 293 calories, 9 grams of fat, 25 grams of protein, and 28 grams of carbs. Before I end this video, I want to talk about how my run went. I log all my runs in Strava. If you have Strava, please add me. I don't really have any like personal friends because <laughs> I don't think any of my friends that do run use Strava. But I do follow like people that I like. Hit a PR today. A PR of um my second fastest time in my mile. So I think my fastest mile was fastest mile was 10 minutes and 49 seconds. And today I did, was that today? Oh yeah, today. Today I did a mile in 11 minutes and seven seconds. So that's pretty good. I am coming off my cycle, so I do expect my energy to get back to normal and for me to, you know, get faster and faster, hopefully. So today altogether I ran 2.16 miles. I burned about 238 calories, not a lot. <laughs> um, and altogether it took me like 28, 29 minutes. So, yeah, and then my Apple Watch actually has more specifics like my cadence and all that, but we don't have to get into that in this video.
<laughs> I like Strava because it shows you like where you ran and then like I like to add little pictures because <laughs> I just think it's fun. I feel good about today's run. It was interval so I did run a mile and then I took a three four minute walk break and then I ran another mile. So it's just basically preparing me for this 10k that I'm trying to train for. I try to eat all my protein today, stretch, stretch, roll my shins out, everything like that and get back to it and we're gonna do full body next. So that's kind of my routine, full body run, full body run um, on a good week. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you found this video interesting. If you are a new runner, please let me know down below any questions you may have and like any tips or tricks you may have. If you are a runner, I would love to hear it. And yeah, again, thank you guys so much for watching. Give me a like if you enjoyed this video and subscribe, join the family. And let me know down below if you like these running vlogs and if you wanna see more of them. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye.